Hey guys, it's Jacob Marine the Funko here. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I've got a box that's been sent to me by a company called Odin's Vault. So yeah, let's get into it. Hey guys, welcome back. So here is the box from Odin's Vault. You can see a really nice sticker of the company here. Uh, I'd have to get some uh, bigger stickers for my boxes because it looks really nice. <laughs> and yeah, the guy that sent me this box was a guy called Steve, a uh, really nice guy. Uh, we've been chatting away for a while now and he decided he wanted to send me something which is always awesome. So they are a new company and Steve who is the owner of the company is also a massive Funko Pop collector just like the rest of us which is awesome. I love it when the owners of these companies are massive collectors themselves because what he did say was that he packages extremely well. Uh, he got tired of other companies just packaging, just not packaging as well. I know Funko, there's some problems with Funko Europe and uh, I know Poppinox have had problems in the past. Yeah, so I think it's just really awesome to see new companies coming up and uh, yeah, he did tell me that he did make sure that every pop that he sends out uh, has no damage on whatsoever, not even like a small tiny crease, which is awesome. So he really does care about his customers, which is really cool. And he's also told me that he's gonna be making custom 10 inch boxes uh, moving, custom movie moment boxes and things like that. Uh, so he's going to be doing some really awesome stuff in the future and I can't wait to see what he sent me. I believe I just told him that what I'm into, so Marvel, Star Wars, Mandalorian, I believe. So I'm really excited to see what is in here and uh, going to see how well his packaging is and everything. So yeah, let's just check it out. Uh, I've, I don't know if he watches my videos at all, so I don't know if he knows the pops that I've got. Uh, but yeah, if we get, you know, duplicate pops or anything, that's still cool because obviously he did send, send it to me for free, which is absolutely amazing. And uh, yeah, I can't thank him enough for that. I just love, uh, obviously it's always cool to get free stuff and I don't get free stuff sent to me too often. Uh, so yeah, it's really cool. Yeah, sent in a really nice steady box, which is always good to see. And let's just check this out. So already I can feel some big bubbles. Uh, which is awesome. Yeah, so already I feel a sticker. So this is the sticker that's on the side of the box, which is awesome. It's a really nice sticker. So this is definitely going to go on the back of my laptop. Uh, as you guys can see here, I've got quite a few stickers already. Um, so yeah, this sticker will join my laptop. So uh, that's really awesome. And uh, I can show boxes. So I'm going to look. I'm gonna show you, also going to show you guys the sort of contents of what I can see. So packaged really well, there's obviously rubber wrap above that. So yeah, he is uh, a man of his word at the moment and uh, sticking, sticking by this because the packaging is insane. Uh, this looks like a bigger box there. So I don't know if it's just Funko Pops or what. Uh, I know he sells predominantly Funko Pops on his website. So I've checked out a bit. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna leave this box to the end because it's kind of intriguing me. and uh, Because I know that these two sorters uh, definitely are Funko Pop shaped. So let's just get everything out of the box for now. Small bubble wrap, don't need to get that out. Right, so let's chuck this away now. So what we are left with is two sorters. And then this box here, which uh, I don't think it is a, I don't know if it's a Funko Pop or not. It looks like from Alien. So we're gonna leave that to the end because that's uh, interesting. It could be like a t-shirt a bundle or something. And uh, let's just get into the first pop that I've been sent by Steve from Odin's Vault. So the first one is, of course it is, it's Wade Wilson uh, from X-Men Wolverine, Origins Wolverine. Uh, yeah, we know the story with this pop. It doesn't actually count for this collection, so this is a very funny one to send me. So yeah, uh, this one will probably feature in one of my uh, upcoming mystery boxes or something. So that's really awesome he sent me this, because obviously I do already have this pop, but um, I am actually looking for the one with the actual con sticker. So uh, yeah, I think that's one of the last ones I actually need for my Deadpool collection. But yeah, still a very cool pop nonetheless, and I will just quickly get my one to show you quickly. So here is my one, so it's a very cool, cool pop. Obviously it's not Deadpool. As a Deadpool fan and a Marvel fan, and you guys will agree with me, we don't associate this character with the amazing character we have today, obviously, played by Ryan Reynolds as well, but it wasn't the true Deadpool we love uh, to see on our screens at the moment. And I'm excited to see what uh, Deadpool 3 does bring us. So anyway, uh, let's just get into 
the next pop, so kind of hoping it's the Mandalorian pop, but uh, I guess we'll find out. See what it is. So, oh, okay. So it's another Marvel pop. I may have just said that I like. I was interested in Marvel. I can't. I can't remember what I told him now. Uh, but this is Adam Warlock. Uh, I don't know a whole lot about this character. So he's actually got the in Infinity Gauntlet there. So I'm guessing he gets all of the stones in the comics. And uh, oh yeah, here's the comic on the back. I do love these Marvel 80 Years boxes. They're just so nice, and I love the uh, little added detail of the. Uh, comic on the back there from where he originates from. It's always the first issue of the character, I believe, uh, on the back. So that's really cool, or whatever this pop associates like with the comic, I guess, because this is him with the uh, Infinity Gauntlet snapping away. Let the conflict end. That's really cool. So very nice pop. Uh, definitely an awesome one to get for free. So uh, thank you, Steve, for these two pops so far. I'm loving that. And uh, yeah, let's get into. This massive thing here, so I'm just going to get these out of the way. So I do believe it looks like it was from Alien, which is very cool. It's Alien? It kind of looks like, you know, that like green blood and... Is it Alien? Yes, it is Alien. Okay, and I was right, it's like a t-shirt t-shirt bundle. So this is a really cool looking uh, box. It's the 40th anniversary, so I'm going to give you a quick spin of the box, because I think it's really nice. Look at that, really cool. Uh, I have seen Alien vs Predator and, and the Alien films, uh, but a very, very long time ago, so um, I don't really have too much uh, knowledge on them at the moment, because I did watch them when I was uh, a lot younger. But uh, yeah, I do really want to rewatch them, and I do think the characters are absolutely awesome. So here is actually, I'm gonna show you the t-shirt first. I do want t-shirts for my videos. Some more geek t-shirts. So this is in a large, which is awesome. That is my size. And here it is. Here is the Alien T. Uh, I think this one's really nice. Uh, I don't usually like them when they're sort of plonked, as you, as you guys know, in the middle. But I think this one works really well because it's quite a dark sort of design. Uh, but then it's got the burst of like green there. It's really cool. And I'm interested to see the pop because uh, I do think, as I said, this character is an awesome one. And this is the... Xenomorph, I think it's uh, I think it's how you pronounce it. So is this metallic -y? This looks like it's quite like a metallic paint job on it. So here he is. The Xenomorph or the Xenomorph. I think it's a Xenomorph sounds better. So I'm gonna say Xenomorph. <laughs> uh, from Alien. So Alien is the one that I do know the most because I have seen that multiple times. Whereas the other ones I've only seen once or twice. Uh, I've seen Alien a lot. And it's a very, very cool film. If you guys haven't seen it, definitely go ahead and uh, watch that sort of franchise. And I will probably be revisiting them soon. Uh, so yeah, these were the three pops that I did get in my uh, Odin's Vault box that I got sent to me. So that's really cool. Three really awesome looking uh, pops here. Sadly, none for my collection. But I can give back to you guys. Maybe I'll give some of these away. Maybe they'll go into mission boxes. I don't know yet. I have just done a giveaway. Uh, so, uh, if you guys don't know, that is being announced on Sunday, so this video should be up Thursday. As always, go ahead, check that out on my Instagram. And, uh, oh yeah, obviously we've got the tea as well, which is awesome. So, yeah, I'm really happy. Uh, thank you so much, Steve. It's kind of a bit surreal when people decide to send me something. Uh, I don't see myself as, as an influencer or something like that to get free stuff. But it's very cool. So, obviously, I'm very happy about that. And uh, yeah, that is everything for today. Uh, definitely go check out Odin's Vault. I'll leave a link in the description. And uh, yeah, make use of my code. Yeah, so if you want your pops in mint condition, obviously these were all in amazing condition. If you're really worried about uh, box condition and you're a, a hardcore inbox collector, uh, I think Odin's Vault might be the place for you. So yeah, definitely go ahead, check them out. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I definitely did. I love getting sent free stuff and mystery stuff is just awesome hope you guys did enjoy this one don't forget to check all my links out in the description all my discount codes and i do sell my regular mystery boxes i should have my marvel and star wars one up now if not it will be up soon i don't know when i'm going to release it yet because <laughs> i do these videos in advance but anyway uh don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe and the bell notifications to get notified when my videos go live and I'll catch you next one <laughs>